One of my most frequent questions is how to make presentations using AI. So today's video will be split into two sections. In the first part, I will show you how to use AI search engines to generate the content for your slides. And in the second part, I will show you how to transform that content into a code that you can import into PowerPoint to create a full presentation. To make a great presentation, you need to start with solid and reliable content. So I was very excited when I learned that there's an AI search engine that actually gets the content from trusted sources. This is called U.com and what makes it special and different from other AI tools is that they have AI modes which I believe will be game changers for students or for teachers. These are located at the bottom and you get some credits to use them when you sign in with your email. To create the content, I want to focus on three main modes that will help us with the structure of our presentation. The first one is the genius mode, which is a very powerful tool that can extract data or content from files. So, for example, if you already have an essay or a document that you need to convert into a presentation, you can upload the document using this paper clip on the right. And then just write something like suggest a structure for a presentation based on this document. And just like that, I got the structure with recommendations on what to put on each slide. This tool is super helpful when you already have a document and you want the AI to help you with something in particular related to that document, like extracting data or analyzing information. However, if you don't have any information already, the research feature is probably my favorite and will be yours too because it can deliver insights and comprehensive answers from trusted sources instead of just delivering generic AI information. So let's suppose we're doing a presentation about about the seven wonders of the world. If I write, give me the content for a presentation about the seven wonders of the world, the tool will start searching for main topics that should be included in a presentation. For example, here it's looking for its history and significance, the modern perspectives, and of course, a list of the seven wonders. The results will even include images and reference all the sources with links if you want to get more information or know exactly where that information is coming from. The final part for creating the content for a presentation has to do with images. And next to the research mode, we have a create mode, which will be the tool to make our images. For example, if we're talking about the old seven wonders of the world, we're gonna have to create those images because those simply don't exist anymore. So we can write a prompt like create three images of the hanging gardens of Babylon. And in just a few seconds, we'll get different options that we could include in our slides. Now that you know how to create the content for your slides, let's learn how to transform it into a code that you can import into PowerPoint to create a full presentation. So let's go back to the research tab and type in something like, give me the content for a presentation about the seven wonders of the world and split it into 10 slides. PowerPoint uses Visual Basic for Applications code or VBA for short. This is a feature to automate certain processes in their apps and u.com is capable of generating this kind of code. So I'll just type in transform the content into VB8 code for a PowerPoint presentation. And look at that, u.com just generated a code that will work in PowerPoint to create our presentation. So I'll just copy it by clicking on the copy icon here at the bottom. Let's open PowerPoint and then go to tools, macro and select visual basic editor. Let's click on insert and select a module. Here's where we'll paste the code that u.com generated for us. Finally, let's just click on the play button here at the top. In just a few seconds, we have our content split across different slides. It's exactly the same one that u.com generated for us. Sure, it doesn't have a design, but that's an easy fix. Let's go back to u.com and click on create to get the images for our presentation. Something very cool is that because this is pretty much a conversational AI tool, we don't need to provide context from our previous conversation because it's already there. So I could just type in create the images that I need for this presentation and you.com already knows it's about the seven wonders of the world. So in just a few minutes, I'll have all the images that I'm going to use. I'll just copy and paste them into every slide in PowerPoint. Finally, let's use the designer feature in PowerPoint to choose a different layout for each slide. 
In just a few minutes, I have a very cool presentation that I made with the help of AI. So there you go, guys. That's how you can create a presentation using AI. Make sure to try out you.com. I'll leave the link in the description box of this video. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your support. And I will see you on my next video.